captain of the Falcons, Danny Wyatt, alongside Dear Flesh and Tish. Um, so, Danny, first loss for the mm. Falcons. Must be quite disappointed. Yeah, we are disappointed, but a positive, we got another bonus point, and I think that's three out of three now for bonus points, which is obviously another win for us. Um, yeah, there's been a few um, last-minute changes, which aren't ideal, but I think um, the way we've gone out there and coped with things off the pitch is really um, promising, and um, hopefully we'll have a full-strength squad for the next game, fingers crossed. On the topic of that, you've been captain again for your second match in the absence of Susie Bates. Mm -hmm. What's the update on her? Uh, she messaged me saying she's feeling a lot better, so um, we've got three days off after today. Um, and her and Cappy will, well, they should be ready for the next game, so that's a big positive. Yeah, and Pirta, great for you. You're playing in your home country. What's it like to play out there alongside the likes of Danny in this massive stadium, taking <laughs> catch, scores and runs? You had it all. Oh, I think, of course, it's a very good opportunity for all of us to display our skills. As well as playing with them, you get to learn so much on the field and off the field, and especially. We've not played our full strength yet, uh, and it's incredible how all the Associate Nation players are taking up the responsibilities on the field. And of course, it's not only playing with these guys, but against them also. I got to face Sophie Eccleston mm -hmm. today, so that was super exciting. Yeah. And also, you faced your um, compatriot, Chaya Mughal, and yeah. she was incredible out there today. Do you still feel, despite the fact you're playing against her, you still feel that sense of pride? Uh, yeah, definitely. Whatever happens on the field, it stays on the field and you're of course happy for everyone who's performed. You want to win a good game by everyone playing well. So I guess you have to appreciate everyone's performances. Right? On, whatever stays on the field, stays on the field. And <laughs> give it to yeah, and Danny, you were captain again today and you brought on Andrew Guran near the end of the innings. You put your trust in her. Mm -hmm. Obviously, she sent Sophia Dunkley's stump flying. What was it like to be on the field and be able to celebrate her first wicket in this tournament. Oh, she's a legend. She works so hard. I was really chuffed for her, the way she's bowled the last few games, actually, and she really deserved the wicket of dunks there. I think I brought mid on up, um, and I knew she was going to try and clear it. So, um, yeah, really chuffed for, for her, and hopefully that's the first of a few more wickets for her. Yeah, and so looking ahead, you've got a few days off. Are you going to be showing them around the local area, giving everyone some ideas what to go and do with a few days? Definitely. Good. What are your plans? You know, get the beach? My plans? Yeah, the plans with the team. Uh, the going team. to the desert, aren't we? Yeah, desert safari is on the list. And of course, for golfing sometime. Mm. Mm. And maybe a bit of rest and recovery <coughs> between now and then. Yeah, You've had two back-to-back sure. -back games. Yeah, definitely. We're going to rest tomorrow, aren't we? And then... Yeah. Um, optional training and then probably train together the day before the next game and really prepare well for that next match. Well, you proved you could do it in the first two games, so I'm sure you'll be come back fighting. Thank you so much for joining us. Enjoy a few days off, get some rest, and we look forward to seeing you in your next game. Thank you. Thank, Thank you very so much. much. Well done. Thank you. Thank you.